This is North Dakota Today. Good morning, good morning. Hi everyone. Welcome on into North Dakota Today. My name is Ashlyn Hill. And I'm Sophia Richards. Happy Thursday. We are, I was going to say, kicking off the week. No. My, brain, my brain thinks it's Monday, apparently. <laughs> I was like, wow, what a week ahead. Mm -hmm. No, Friday Eve, my bad. Yeah. We're rounding out a big week. Yes. One more day. We can do it. Yeah. One more day. And we have a really incredible show today. Mm -hmm. A sneak peek as to what John David Birdall is already setting up in studio today. We're getting crafty there, getting creative. We're getting into scrapbooking, which is somebody here's favorite. Oh, yeah. I think I talked about it a little bit on my first yeah, day when on I was on the couch. Day. It is my favorite hobby. It's my newfound love. And <laughs> I could not be more excited. Oh, so same. I'm just... We're going to get over there and make some memories on oh, yeah. pages, everybody. All right, we're letting him set up. We'll get to that in a moment. But uh, we have a, a big thing to recap. How was your evening, fashionista? Yes, so yesterday was the Fabo Fashion Show. It was an absolute blast. Mm -hmm. It went amazing. Um, we had, I think, over 200 people, almost oh, wow. 300 people there. Okay, so who's this? Yes, so this is all of the Fabo members. So this is everyone who worked very hard to put the show together. Mm. Um, so that is all of us, our little dream team. Yeah. That was me. I was running the music. Oh, I was going to say, you look like you're DJing. <laughs> yes, so DJ I was Sophia DJ Sophia yesterday. On yeah. the track. Yeah, and I have my fashion show outfit on. So I was, ran back in my little dress and yeah. I was checking the music. Oh, cute. Okay, close up. Yep, and then that's some of my friends who are in Fabo as well. And it was really, honestly, I got a little bit emotional yesterday because I'm a senior. And yeah. Fabo has been something that I've been involved with for years. So Will you remind us again what that stands for? Fashion Apparel Business Organization. Fashion Apparel. Yes. Okay, okay. Yes, um, at NDSU. And obviously something you're passionate about. Mm -hmm. I remember when you had the whole girl gang on to yes. talk about the show. So how was it really walking? It was so exciting and the crowd was really into it. Um, one of the best parts of the show is we have student designers come on. Yeah. So they work all year, or I guess I'm not really sure how long. <laughs> on <laughs> Their whole lives. Yeah, their entire you know. lives. Um, on these really amazing looks. And so they're able to actually model what they've sewn in the fashion show wow. and the crowd just loves it. It's yeah. so cool to see the creativity from NDSU students. It was really cool. It sounds incredibly exciting. Yes. You are living your best life, mm -hmm. the glitz, the glam. <laughs> we were making jokes this morning and I just want to show everyone the stark, stark contrast of reality <laughs> of our day-to-day -day lives, Sophia and I. Mm -hmm. uh, her glimpse was a fashion show where she was DJing and you know that incredible organization that was her, her Wednesday afternoon. Mm -hmm. Here's a glimpse into my reality of a Wednesday afternoon. Uh, I was sitting at my hair appointment slurping down my Starbucks <laughs> Frappuccino. You know when they clip your hair and you look crazy and there's just something about that cape that really makes you think, is this who I really am? Um, and I was joking about how our, our difference in days and then we all voted in the newsroom, Jordan especially, that I had to put in my photo too. Mm -hmm. So from fashion shows to Frappuccinos, mm -hmm. we've got you covered <laughs> right here on North Dakota Today. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, shout out to Hair Success because your hair is popping. I love it, right? Love it's it. nice and bright yeah. for summer. I'm ready. Yes, Hair Success, you you guys always do great work. I love going into that salon. Mm -hmm. uh, it, there's a boutique, there's a whole spa. I, anything you want done, they have it there. So yes. yes, 10 out of 10 recommend. Definitely. And I have my appointment on Friday. Oh. I'm getting highlights too, not as bright as yours. Oh, I will, yeah. A little that something, makes sense. something for summer. Yeah, exactly. Up. Yeah, so exactly. I'm excited. Very seasonal hair trends, you know, yes. brightening for summer, then you go dark in the fall. Mm -hmm. Typical girl things. Oh, yeah. The gals at home get it. If you get it, you get it. <laughs> also, okay, huge, huge reminder, the NFL draft kicking off today. It mm -hmm. is finally happening. We've had so many of our Bison Nation friends joining us here in studio. Uh, but Kansas City, Missouri, round one. <laughs> yes, so round one is tonight. <laughs> At 8 p.m. Eastern Time. Yes, and then we've got uh, three days of this, but we have so many friends that are going to be on the list. Sophia knows how to pronounce all of their names. She's here to help. Well, there are don't give me like too 10 much of them. 
There's like 10 of our Bison friends mm -hmm. really up right now for this draft, and it's just, it's incredible to be in this region and to be a fan of this team and then to see how many of them could really truly go on to success. So I think we have the list of everybody, right? Yeah, isn't that amazing how yeah. much talent just in Fargo? I mean, that's crazy. Yeah, you don't realize it until you get here, or of course you do realize it if you've been a fan of college football your yes. whole life. <laughs> yeah, so, okay, here is the list of the NFL prospects. Mm -hmm. So it's Dawson Weber. Spencer Wagey, who we had just yesterday yes. on the couch. Nice guy. Um, Michael Tootsie. Tootsie. <laughs> Tootsie. <laughs> Tootsie. All right, we Calvary. gave her too much credit. Yep, yep. We better I, call Devin Fry in here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dustin Talbert, Cody Malk, who we also had. He's so nice. Um, Hunter Lubke, Nash Jensen, and Noah Gindorf. Okay. Congrats to all of you. It's just an incredible feat to even be a prospect, to mm -hmm. even get this far. So very, very cool. If you at home are your fans, I'm sure you are. It's Bison Nation. How could you not be? Yes. Uh, just get prepared to cheer on the boys, cheer on the home team starting tonight. So that'll be exciting. And we did touch on it. We are going to be scrapbooking. It's perfect timing, though. We learned that. Sophia loves it. It's her favorite hobby. Mm -hmm. uh, I used to dibble, dabble into it. But like every other hobby I've ever started in my yep. life, I gave up after <laughs> a few months. Working on that, um, but I'm actually in the midst of making a scrapbook, a mixed media scrapbook for my nephew's graduation mm -hmm. present. So instead of just something um, just with photos and memories, I'm stashing gift cards and cash in the pages too. Which is the best kind. Well, that's what I'm thinking too, because he's yeah. a boy and I don't think he'll care about these photos at all. It's just <laughs> us sentimental folks who are like, oh, remember when we did this? And they're like, whatever. <laughs> So I was like, you know, I'm hacking, I'm hacking the code here. I'm like, yeah. okay, I know how to get it interesting. So when you bury money in the pages, mm -hmm. that's the best way to do it. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, but John David's joining us. We'll go uh, live over there with him and get a little creative. And then we'll get some tips from Sophia as well. So we've got a really exciting show for you guys today. So glad you could join us. And uh, yeah, stick around. Coming up, we're getting crafty with John David.